Begin this meditation by just finding yourself in a comfortable position. Remembering that when you meditate, it's not so much about the outer posture, but rather the inner posture that you're cultivating here. And whether you're sitting down on a chair or lying down on the floor or on your bed, just taking a moment to reflect on the only moment where your life is unfolding. Here and only here. Now and only right now. And as you sit here, I want you to imagine that you're on a nice bed of grass and it's a beautiful summer day. And in front of you, you see the most beautiful and peaceful river. And as you sit here, you can feel that part of you that has been and always will be. And you realize that in this moment, that peaceful river you see in front of you is your mind containing all of the thoughts and the feelings that you experience from moment to moment in every moment of your life. And in this practice, I want you to just notice how your river is in this moment. As you watch your river without any sort of judgment or needing it to be a certain way, I want you to simply watch. Not trying to speed your river up, not trying to slow your river down, but just noticing everything that you find here with a simple, non judgmental, and peaceful, ah, that's how it is. And maybe with this new energy, you can also greet negative things you may find in your river with the same energy as you greet the more positive things. Maybe as you watch your river, which contains random thoughts about things you may need to do tomorrow, deep feelings, whether they're dark and anxious or depressed or light and joyous and free with the same non-judgmental, non-doing mind. And in this moment, I want you to actually feel what it's like to greet everything that you find in your river, which represents your mind, with a peaceful sense of non-judgment. If you're like me and most people, this exercise and this practice may feel sort of freeing in this moment because you don't have to feel any certain way except for the way that you are feeling right now. Just greeting, however quick, however dark, however light, however slow, however rocky, however blue or white, or black you find your river at this moment with a simple, with a peaceful, with a non-judgmental greeting of, ah, that's how it is right now.
and in this 12 minute meditation, just trying that on for just a few minutes more. And now I also want you to do something else, which is to pay attention to the difference between you, the part of you that always was and always will be, the part of you that is greater than thoughts, that may contain a mind and a brain, but is not defined by it, the part of you that is soulful, the part of you that is loving, the part of you that has no boundaries, not even the boundaries of time or your physical body, and that river. So many times we jump into that river and we think that we are that river, that we are our thoughts, that we are our feelings. So in this moment, I want you to just feel the difference between who you truly are and that river that is thoughts, that is feelings. And while you may look to the river for information, and while you may look to the river to help you to make decisions, you feel the difference when you actually know that that river is not you. That you are just so much greater than what you find in that river. That you are not your thoughts. And you are not your feelings. And maybe in that moment when you can actually touch that separation between your mind and you, you actually are filled with that feeling of connection to all human beings and maybe the boundaries of time and your physical body even fade away. And maybe in this moment you also can cultivate a lighter touch in the way you relate to what you find in your thought and feeling stream at any given moment. Since you're not trying to jump in the river and change the color of it or the speed of it. And you can do that because you have this sense, this intuition, this feeling that you are so much greater than what you find there. And when you can greet the darkest fear or anxious feeling with the same sort of non-judgment and allowing as you greet the greatest, lightest joy that you find in that river. Maybe in this moment you feel this sense of freedom. And maybe your thoughts and your feelings at any given moment aren't going to feel so heavy to you. Maybe you can let those thoughts and feelings roll off your back just a little bit more. And perhaps that new energy that you are cultivating in this 12 minute meditation and this practice is going to set you free in so many ways so that the part of you that is you, the part of you that has always been and always will be, that can pay attention to your thoughts and feelings, but not be ruled by them, not be held hostage by them. 
maybe that eternal part of you, that truest part of you, the part of you that is light, can start to make the decisions that truly change your life. Maybe that part of you that is you creates a life that is filled with love and compassion even when you find your river filled with judgment or grudges or anger or anxiety or depression. And in this moment, it's so magical and it's so miraculous even because you are setting yourself free so that whatever you find in your river can just be a piece of information you use to guide your life but are also not governed by it. bathing in this energy in these last few seconds in the only moment where your life is unfolding right here and right now